Good afternoon. Detectives are sweeping the neighborhood where the city's latest officer involved shooting took place. They've been going door to door asking people what they may have seen or heard last night. News 13's Cole Miller is live in the Albuquerque foothills with the latest. Cole. Kim, this area near Copper and Tramway was crawling last night with cops well into this morning. Now we haven't heard from APD today, but neighbors are talking. This is what things looked like this morning. Uh, as you mentioned, detectives knocking on doors, trying to find out exactly what happened from those who live here nearby. Now, last night, APD Chief Gordon Eden says a man was camping illegally in the foothills in this area. Open space officers responded, followed by members of the crisis intervention team, as well as state police. Eden says this man grew irritated, even threatening to kill officers. Less than lethal force was then used, and Eden says a shot was fired. As of last night, we were told this man is in critical condition. Neighbors we spoke with say they heard more than one shot, though. Some say anywhere from three to six. We heard a couple gunshots. There was a bigger caliber gun that started it, and then a couple of the smaller ones that kept on going off. And then we saw, like I guess, four or five cops up in the hill and with some lights just shining down. Like, I think they took someone down, but that's all we really saw. And other neighbors we spoke to off camera said they could see sharpshooters out here in the foothills. And one neighbor says he saw another person with this man. Now, none of this has been confirmed. Again, we're hoping to hear from APD later this afternoon. Kim, back to you. OK, thanks, Cole. Now, this is the first officer involved shooting since Eden took over as Albuquerque's chief in late February.